Good evening to you. Well, Plan A was soon ditched this morning as the rain set in across eastern England and stayed there for much of the day. In fact, at Folkestone, 36 millimetres of rain fell in just 24 hours. Pretty good prospects for the cricket at Lords tomorrow, though. 20% chance of a shower, perhaps. I think that could be late in the day. It could be all over by that time. The problems are out to the southwest. That deepening area of low pressure is moving in all the time. The winds are going to be fairly light tonight for most of us, but freshening winds in the far west and probably reaching gale force towards the, towards the end of the day as that deep area of low pressure moves up towards southwestern parts of Ireland. So temperatures aren't any problem tonight, holding up in double figures everywhere. But the mist and fog could be a problem for central and eastern parts, developing more widely after all the moisture that we've seen during the day. And the freshening wind bringing a few showers northwards up the western side of the country. That's how we'll be in the morning then. There'll be some hazy sunshine for much of the day, in fact, over some central and eastern parts of the country. Out in the west, always more cloudy, further share bursts of rain to come. And I fancy that during the afternoon there could be some uh, longer spells of rain, perhaps, moving up the western side of Scotland. The shower's getting heavier too, and there could be the odd rumble of thunder, but one or two showers eventually getting to the eastern side, maybe very late in the day. Temperatures then 23 in the east, 21 in the west, but a freshening wind. And then with that low pressure close by on Monday, it's sunshine and squally showers throughout the country. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.